Hi guys and welcome back um, on the second video of uh, the butterfly project. Okay, uh, now we have uh, a butterfly wrapped up and uh, uh, we will start uh, shipping uh, uh, the wings, uh, the body, the head and so on. So uh, we will start to see our butterfly coming up. Okay, so let's start. So guys, let's start uh, to define uh, how much thin wings uh, will be, okay? So basically we just uh, place a mark uh, on the wings uh, just to say that uh, the wings uh, will start approximately here, it's okay? And uh, then we will start to refine and shape the wings to reach uh, uh, the desired uh, thickness. Okay, so I'll make me we will uh, make them very as as thin as possible. Okay, without breaking the wing, obviously. Okay, so uh, once uh, we have the mark, just to make the wing start at the same uh, level of the body. Okay, we will uh, uh, start to remove wood until we reach the desired thickness. Okay, so let's start. Now, before continue carving uh, our butterfly, uh, the first thing that uh, we have to do now is to continue trace the center line all uh, around uh, the body of the butterfly. This uh, will give us an idea on uh, uh, where carve to round uh, the body. Okay, so let's start uh, and. Uh, Continue by the center line that we already drew here. Okay, we continue here and then we we go all around the body. Okay. Just draw uh, freehand uh, without using a ruler or so on because. In this way, uh, you don't need to lose too much time to redraw your line. Okay, so as you can see, it comes perfectly with the back one. Okay, so now we will uh, start uh, and continue carve the body of the butterfly while uh, making thin. The wings, okay? 
So let's start. Okay, another advice is uh, while uh, you are reaching uh, the desired thickness uh, of the wing, uh, uh, always uh, keep an eye on uh, the wood grain direction. Okay, uh, doing so will uh, prevent uh, uh, wood from, from uh, tearing off. Okay, and uh, also uh, while uh, carving, also uh, take uh, often a look. Uh, to the uh, wall shape of the of the butterfly just to see if uh, you are going in the right direction or if you need more work uh, on one wing uh, rather than uh, the other wing okay so always uh, take a look take a look and also uh, take some distance from the uh, from the butterfly okay because uh, this will uh, give you a better view of uh, how the project uh, is going on okay so continue and also now for example you have to take a look here to the body okay because the body uh, is uh, going wider here but uh, more thick here more thin here so we need to uh, uh, project uh, this thing also to the uh, other side okay so here we will need to make uh, the body more thin okay just uh, in this uh, position more or less okay always uh, double check also with the other side okay and always try to uh, draw before carve okay Okay, so let's continue. that uh, we are uh, quite near to the desired thickness uh, okay we can proceed uh, all with the knife okay so in this way we can just uh, remove and look uh, what we have just removed uh, to see if uh, is uh, working for uh, uh, 
our project okay uh, also uh, with the knife uh, we can uh, just remove a small amount of wood also in uh, some uh, not uh, easy uh, point like uh, here where the two wings we go one over the other okay so we just have to remove uh, this uh, wood uh, just to clean uh, the the wing Okay. okay so the next thing is uh, now how can we uh, can enrich our project because at this stage uh, uh, wings uh, are pretty flat okay there is no uh, an interesting movement uh, of the uh, wing so it's not uh, uh, the wing uh, is not currently have uh, the um, right shadow to make uh, this project uh, uh, or maybe to make the wing interesting at a first look okay so what we can do to enrich our carving is to first uh, draw uh, for example a line like this one okay like the butterfly uh, the real butterfly no? if you uh, take a look at the at butterfly you can see that uh, over the wing they have uh, some uh, uh, drawing okay let me call them uh, in this way okay so we can just also do this onto the other wings okay try to draw them uh, much equal between them uh, as possible but if you are not uh, good uh, in drawing like me maybe just uh, try to give an idea on what you have to do okay then we can uh, so maybe do some uh, okay we can then uh, carve all around here with the uh, V gouge okay Okay, then from uh, from the center line of this uh, area okay you then go uh, low, lower and rounding this part to reach uh, the other side of the wing okay so in this way if you prefer you can also use a mallet but the wing is uh, uh, quite thin, so it's uh, better to go by hand. Okay. Now is not at the right moment to do uh, to use the sanding paper, but just to show you how the butterfly will. Uh, Look, okay. it's not uh, so much uh, visible and uh, it uh, still need works. But uh, look at the wings, uh, okay? So the wings uh, will be much more uh, uh, interesting. But that's my opinion, okay? So continue and do this kind of work also on the other side.
Basically, now that uh, we don't have uh, any suitable surface uh, for clamping uh, the project into a vise, I removed the vise and uh, we will uh, uh, continue carving here by maybe uh, using a gouge, always taking care to keep your hand behind the gouge in this way, okay? Maybe you can use one finger here to hold it and one to uh, guide the, the gouge, okay? And uh, we will continue uh, shaping wings and uh, the body until uh, we get the shape uh, we desire. Okay, so let's go. Okay, before continue shipping the wings, okay, uh, I draw here, and here, two lines to um, make uh, the the wing uh, more uh, uh, curvy, not not so uh, straight, okay, because uh, uh, we here we have uh, uh, a cure here, and also one here that. Uh, in my opinion, uh, make the wings uh, more uh, beautiful. Okay, but uh, it depends on how you would like to uh, carve your uh, butterfly. Okay, this is my uh, point of view. Okay.
Okay guys, so what we have done now uh, is uh, shaping our butterfly, okay? So uh, maybe more or less we uh, will adjust uh, something else, uh, but uh, it's quite uh, uh, near the uh, picture I have in mind of the, the butterfly, okay? So we work across uh, the wings, uh, the body, and uh, also the back of the butterfly, okay? And also we have had uh, some uh, uh, design to the uh, main wings, okay? So, uh, in the next uh, video, what we will uh, do, we'll uh, add uh, some detail, maybe we can add uh, the high, uh, the antennas, and uh, maybe we can uh, undercut uh, the wings. Okay? So, hope you enjoyed uh, the video and uh, see you on the uh, next video. Cheers! Bye!